Do you want your plan to look more professional? So, follow this tutorial. Hello everyone, welcome to the PostPro Master YouTube channel. In this tutorial, you will learn how to make your plans more professional in Photoshop to use in your presentations. First of all, we should have a raw plan in PNG or PDF format. It's recommended to be separated from background layer, then to achieve harmony and high speed in working it's better to make a concept palette including colors, materials, and some important objects. Choose the color by eyedropper tool and apply it to the plan walls and windows with paint bucket. Create a new layer and check the all layers. Then you can adjust the opacity of the layer. To color open areas, first select the space by rectangular marquee tool, then use color bucket. Change the blending mode of the layer to multiply to appear dark shapes of back layers. I recommend you to use different colors for different type of spaces, for example wet and dry spaces. For using images as floor material patterns, you can easily copy the image to your document. Control A for selecting the whole image, Control C for copy, and in your document, press Control V to paste it here. You can adjust the image by Control T. Copy the image with holding Alt key and drag the layer to fill the room. Merge with other part and erase extra parts. Then you can adjust the opacity of the layer.
This are the all commands you should use to fill any type of plans in any projects. Do the similar actions for other images and patterns to complete it. Now it's time to the interesting part, making cast shadows. First of all, pick the polygonal lasso tool, then draw the shape of shadow on the ground. The important point is angle of light. In this tutorial, the position of sun is in the southwest, so all of the shadows must show that. Now it's time to remove extra shapes and add some shadows under the windows. Thank you. 
Now let's add trees. Just like other images, you can copy the image and paste it in your file. Adjust it by Control T. To change the color of the tree, double click on the layer. The layer style window will appear. In the left side of the window, check the color overlay and open the adjustments by clicking on it. Change the color to any color that you want and finally adjust the opacity. The final step is making a background. Choose the pen tool. Try to draw an area by curvy line. In the path window, click on the third circle to make path to selection. Create new layer. Fill the selected area with a color. Change the blending mode to multiply. Then repeat last commands to achieve a harmonized background. Remove the extra parts. Use a soil image or something like that to fill all the background. It helps to combine all the elements that we have used. It's better to readjust the opacity of the layers once in a while. Copy some of the trees for use in the landscape. Create shadow double click on the layer and drop shadow tab adjust this setting. Now you can see and compare the final result. 
This is how you can simply present a raw plan for any kind of use. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Please like this video if you enjoyed it. Hit the subscribe button. Wait for our next interesting tutorials. Don't forget to follow our other social media pages to keep up with our new tutorials.